So here we are. Morning stretch. Good morning. My name is Marissa. We're going to start coming down to all fours, hands and knees. So just come down with your hands right under your shoulders and your knees right under your hips and tuck your toes. Then look up to the ceiling and arch your spine. Look into your belly and round your spine. Do it three more times. Inhale, arch and look up. Exhale, round and look in. Do it two more times. Inhale, arch and look up. Exhale, round and look in. Do it one more time. Inhale, arch and look up. Exhale, round and look in. Come to a neutral spine, just a flat back. Keep your toes tucked, but come up onto high finger pads and then take your right arm to the ceiling and look up. And then scoop this right arm inside of the left arm, you're twisting, and go back up. Seven, scoop and lift. Six, scoop and lift. Five, scoop and lift. Four, scoop and lift. Three, scoop and lift. Two, scoop and lift. One, scoop and lift. Take this hand down. Let's do the second side right away. Take your left arm to the ceiling, look up to see your thumb. Scoop this arm inside the right, you're twisting, and up. Seven, scoop, and lift. Six, up. Five, up. Four, up. Three, up. Two, up. One, up. Take this hand down. Step your right foot outside your right pinky finger. Take your left arm to the ceiling. Look up to see your thumb. Breathe here. Let's scoop this left arm inside the right. Eight, up. Seven, up. Six, up. Five, up. Four, up. Three, up. Two, up. One, up, turn the palm forward, reach the arm over your ear, take this hand down. Lift your right knee to the sky behind you, flex your foot, then take the knee and the foot down. The right knee comes up and down, three up and down, four up and down, five up and down, six up and down, seven up and down, eight up and down. Left foot steps outside of the left pinky finger, right arm comes to the ceiling, look up to see your thumb, scoop this arm inside of the left leg and back up. Seven, scoop and lift. Six, up, five, up, four, up, three, up, two, up, one, turn the palm forward, reach the arm over your ear. Take this hand down, take your left knee to the sky, flex your foot, lower the left knee and the left foot down and up, two, down and up, three, up, four, up, five, up, six, up, seven, up, Eight, return to all fours, hands and knees. Plant your hands flat. Move your knees backwards a good six inches. Send your shoulders forward over your wrist. It's a long all fours position. Then pull your butt back towards your heels. Let's move with that. The shoulders come forward over the wrist without dropping your pelvis. And then send your butt back. Do it three more times. Come forward, shoulders over wrist. Keep your pelvis lifted and then go backwards. Do it two more times, coming forward and going backwards. One more time, coming forward and going backwards. Stay backwards, loop your right arm under the left, take the right side of your head down to the ground. Return your right arm forward, loop your left arm under the right, take the left side of your head down to the ground. Return your left arm forward, move your shoulders forward over your wrist, lift your knees up, you're in the top of a push-up, a plank position. Breathe here. Go upwards and backwards, downward facing dog. Come forward to plank, shoulders over wrists. Again, don't sag your pelvis so your hips are lifted. Go backwards, downward facing dog. Do it one more time, forward to plank, backwards to downward facing dog. 
look between your hands and walk your feet forward in between your hands. Come to the front edge, your feet are two fists width and parallel. Inhale, lift yourself to a tabletop, so your back looks like a tabletop. Exhale, fold over. Do it three more times. Inhale, tabletop. Exhale, fold. Two more, inhale, tabletop. Exhale, fold. One more, inhale, tabletop. Exhale, fold. Step your right leg long back behind. You're in a low lunge. Tap your right knee outside of your right elbow. Eight, lunge. Seven, lunge. Six, lunge. Five, lunge. Four, lunge. Three, lunge. Two, lunge. One, stay in the lunge. Lift your left arm up. You're in a twist. Tap this hand down. Keep the elbow straight. Going up and down. Three, down. Four, down. Five, down. Six, down. Seven, down. Eight, let's alternate. Right knee, right elbow and back, left arm up and down, forward, back, up, down, three, forward, back, up, down, four, forward, back, up, down, five, forward, back, up, down, six, forward, back, up, down, seven, forward, back, up, down, eight, forward, back, up, down, walk your back foot forward, the feet are apart. Inhale, lift your back to a tabletop. Exhale, fold over. Bend your knees and put your hands on your thighs. Push off your thighs, come to stand up. Lift your shoulders up, back and down. Three more, up, back and down. Two more, up, back and down. One more, up, back and down. Clasp your hands at your low back. Stay there, I just wanna give you the side view. Lift your knuckles away from your body, stretching your shoulders. Feel a stretch across your chest. Dive forward. The crown of your head goes down to the ground. Your knuckles go overhead to the wall out in front of you. Keep your hands clasped and come all the way back up and then lean backwards, presenting your heart to the sky. Come upright. Take your hands to hold onto your hip bones. Take your right knee to the ground behind you. Take your left knee to the ground behind you. Bring your hands down onto the mat. Return to all fours with your hands right under your shoulders and your knees right under your hips. Tuck the toes, look to the ceiling, arch your spine. Look into your belly, round your spine. Do it three more times. Inhale, arch and look up. Exhale, round and look in. Two more, inhale, arch and look up. Exhale, round and look in. One more, inhale, arch and look up. Exhale, round and look in. Come to a neutral spine, it's just a flat back. Go up onto high finger pads. Step your left foot inside of your left thumb. Step your right foot inside of your right thumb. Separate the feet, that five, six inches apart. Inhale, lift to a flat back tabletop. Exhale, fold over. Step your left leg long back behind, you're in a low lunge. Tap your left knee outside your left elbow. Eight, lunge. Seven, lunge. Six, lunge. Five, lunge. Four, lunge. Three, lunge. Two, lunge. One, take your right arm to the ceiling, you're in a twist. Take it down. Seven, up and down. Six, down. Five, down. Four, down, three, down, two, down. Let's alternate the back knee touching the left elbow and coming up forward, right arm up and down. So we go in, back, up, down, three in, back, up, down, four in, back, up, down, five in, back, up, down, six in, back, up, down, seven in, back, up, down, eight in, back, up, down. Walk your back foot forward. Separate the feet. Lift your torso to a flat back. Exhale, fold over. Take your hands to hold onto your hip bones. Point your elbows to the sky. With a flat back, come all the way up to stand. Take your right knee into your chest and then step the foot down. Two up and down. Three, down. Four, down. Five, down. Six, down. Seven, down, eight, do it the left foot, up, down, 
two, down three, down four, down five, down six, down seven, down eight. Lift your right knee up, open it out to the right side, return it to center and take it down. Do it again. Up, out, center, down three, out, center, down four, out, center, down five, out, center, down six, out, center, down seven, out, center, down eight, out, center, down. Do it with the left leg, up, out, center, down two, out, center, down three, out, center, down four, out, center, down five, out, center, down six, out, center, down seven, out, center, down eight, out, center, right leg comes up. We open it to the side. We're gonna make a circle. It dips a little behind to come forward and up. Same leg, out, behind, forward and up. Three, out, behind, forward and up. Four, out, behind, forward and up. Five, out, behind, forward and up. Six, out, behind, forward and up. Seven, out, behind, forward and up. Eight, out, behind, forward and up. Let's take it down, do it with the left leg up, out, it dips down a little bit, then to come forward and up, it's a big circle. Two, back behind, forward and up. Three, back behind, forward and up. Four, back behind, forward and up. Five, back behind, forward and up. Six, back behind, forward and up. Seven, back behind, forward and up. Eight, back behind, forward and up, take it down. Take the right knee up, Open the right knee out to the side, make that circle, come back forward. Take the back of your left wrist to hold, it's like touching the outside of the right knee, the back of the left wrist, outside of the right knee. Take the right arm behind you. You might look backwards. Then keep the arms and the legs, look forward. We're coming down to a twist. Take the right hand forward and to the ground, the right leg long back behind you on the ground, the left arm to the ceiling. So you're in a twist. Breathe here. From here, let's plant the right hand flat. Turn your left toes out to the left. Walk your left foot outside in line with your left hip so you're walking it backwards. Take your back foot to the pinky blade of your foot. So the back foot, you're on the pinky blade so that your back sole of your foot is exposed. Lift your hips up, take the left arm and scoop it inside of the right and lift it up. Two, scoop and lift. Three, scoop and lift. Four, scoop and lift. Five, scoop and lift. Six, scoop and lift. Seven, scoop and lift. Eight, scoop and lift. Take the hand down, come out to a plank position, the top of a push up. Go upwards and backwards, downward facing dog. Look between your hands and walk your feet forward in between your hands. Separate your feet four, five, six inches apart. Inhale to a tabletop. Exhale, fold over. Take your hands to hold your hip bones. Point your elbows towards the sky. Lift yourself up with a flat back. Lift your left knee up. Open your left knee out to the side, then make that circle, it comes forward and up again. Take the back of your right wrist to the outside of your left knee. Take your left arm behind you, look back to see your left hand. Keep the arms and the legs, look forward. Let's come down with the left hand to the ground, the left leg long back behind, the right arm up. It's a twisted low lunge. We'll plant the left hand flat. We'll turn the right toes out. We're gonna walk this right foot backwards so it's in line with the hip. The back foot tilts to the pinky blade of the foot. So your back foot is on the pinky blade. Your sole of the foot is exposed. Lift your hip, look up to see your top thumb. Then follow this thumb with your gaze as you scoop this arm inside and up. Seven, scoop and up. Six, up, five, up, four, up, three, up, two, up, 
one up let's come out to a regular plank position top of a push-up go upwards and backwards downward facing dog look between your hands and walk your feet forward your feet end up those five six inches apart inhale to a flat back exhale fold over take your hands to hold your hip bones with that flat back come all the way up to stand bend your knees and tap your toes then tap your knees toes knees three knees four knees five knees six knees seven knees eight knees take your hands outside of your feet drop your head and straighten your legs as best you can then rebend them straighten and bend straighten and bend two more straighten and bend one more straighten and bend we're going to try to come up to stand with the right knee into the chest, clasping the hands over the right shin. So you're trying to come up with the right knee into the chest, clasping your hands over your right shin. We'll go right back down to that forward bend with our legs straight. Let's try to come up with the left knee into the chest. We'll clasp the hands over the left shin. We're trying to come up. We'll go back down to that forward bend. We'll straighten the legs. Let's come up with the right knee into the chest. We'll take the left hand to hold the left hip bone. We'll point the right foot. Take your right hand to hold the top of the right foot and then turn your right knee down towards the ground. Then lift your right thigh parallel to the floor. So by lifting your right thigh, you might tilt forward a little bit, that's okay. But the objective is not that we want our torso parallel to the ground. We want our back thigh parallel to the ground. You do end up tilting forward a little bit. Let's take the left arm to the ceiling. And in fact, we'll connect the left index finger and thumb. We'll just come to stand up. The hands will come down by our side. Let's go back over to a forward bend. We'll come up with the left knee into the chest. We'll clasp the hands over the left shin. Take your right hand to hold your right hip bone point your left foot take your left hand to hold the top of your left foot point your left knee to the floor then lift your left thigh parallel to the floor in order to do that you might end up tilting forward a little bit but it's not that we're trying to come forward we're trying to keep our torso upright reach the right arm to the ceiling connect your right index finger and thumb let's come out just standing up Take your legs wide apart. Take your arms to a T shape. Twist your upper body to the right and come back to center. Right and center. Two more, right and center. One more, right. Stay to the right. Take your left hand to the outside of your right leg. Take your right arm to the ceiling. Look up. Stay in the twist, come back up in the twist, your left arm forward, your right arm backward. Return to center in a T shape to me. Let's twist to the left and return to center. Three more, left and center. Two more, left and center. One more, stay in the twist. Come down with your right hand outside your left ankle, left arm to the ceiling. You're in a twist. Let's stay in the twist and come back up with the left arm reaching backwards, right arm reaching forward. Then return to me, you're in this T shape. Take your hands to your hip bones and bring your torso parallel to the ground. Then take your hands down right under your shoulders. Your heels remain down, but walk your hands forward, keeping your heels down. Can you get your shoulders over your wrists? Plant your hands flat. Then drop your head and tug your chest backwards through your legs. Breathe here. Take your hands to hold your ankles, right hand, right ankle, left hand, left ankle, drop your head down. Return your hands forward, your heels stay down. Walk your shoulders forward over your wrists. Send your right hand in between the two hands. There's a space between the hands. Put the right hand in the middle of that space so your right hand is flat under your face. Take your left arm to the ceiling and look up. Scoop this left arm inside of the right. Eight, lift it up. 
seven, lift it up. Six, up. Five, up. Four, up. Three, up. Two, up. One, put both hands down on the ground. Just separate your hands. Now you have this space between your hands. Put your left hand to the middle of that space. So your left hand is right under your face. Take your right arm to the ceiling. You're in a twist. Scoop this right arm inside of the left. Eight, lift it up. Seven, lift it up. Six, up. Five, up. Four, up. Three, up. Two, up. One. Let's take both hands down. Separate the hands. Move your shoulders forward over the wrist, but keep your heels down. Go up onto high finger pads, walk your hands backwards, take your hands to your hip bones, bend your right knee, keep the left leg straight, see if you can get your torso upright, then straighten. So we'll bend the left knee, the torso's upright. So let's just go side to side, bending right knee and left knee, right and left, right and left. Let's do four more, four, left, three, left. Two, left, one, left. Come to center, straighten the legs. Let's add the arms. So you can always stay here with holding onto the hips. Otherwise, try bending the right knee and the hands tap down, coming back up. Let's just go to the right. Right, up, three, up, four, up, five, up, six, up. Seven, up, eight, up. So while you were going down, you were bending the knee. When you were coming up, you were straightening the knee. We'll do the same thing on the left side. We'll bend the knee, the hands come down. We'll straighten the leg, the hands come up. Two, up, three, up, four, up, five, up, six, up, seven, up, eight, up, let's alternate it. Go right, up, left, up, two right, up, left, up, three right, up, left, up, four right, up, left, up, five right, up, left, up, six right, up, left, up, seven right, up, left, up, eight right, up, left, let's alternate it without the center. So you're going right and left, two, left, three, left, four, left, five, left, six, left, seven, left, eight, Let's go left to right, left, right, two, right, three, right, four, right, five, right, six, right, seven, right, eight. Come to center, your legs are straight, your hands are on your hips. Heel toe your feet so that the feet come right under the hips. The feet are what's known as hip width apart. Keep your legs straight, fold forward, tap your toes. Take your hands to your hips and come all the way up. Fold forward, tap your toes. Hands to the hips and come up. Tap the toes and back to the hips. Three down and up. Four down and up. Five down and up. Don't lock your legs. Six down, the legs are straight but the knees are not locked. Let's do it just one more time. Down and up. Take your hands down. Lift your right arm to the ceiling, side bend over to the left. Your left hand is gliding down the left side of your leg. Come back up, take the right hand down, take your left arm up, side bend over to the right, that your right hand is coming down the side of your leg. Come back up, take the hand down. Let's alternate, go over to the right and come up. Go over to the left and come up. Three more. Right and left. 
two more. Right. And left. One more. Right. And left. Come back up, clasp your hands behind your head, your elbows go wide apart. Lift yourself up and lean backwards like you're trying to get your torso parallel to the ceiling. Then come upright, narrow your elbows in, bend your knees and bring your elbows down to touch your knees. Let's keep the hands clasped and come all the way back up. Widen your elbows arc backwards. Do it three more times. Go down and in, up and backwards. Do it two more times, down and in, up and backwards. Do it one more time, down and in, up and backwards. Stay up and backwards, release the hands, reach the arms backwards. It's like you're stretching over a huge rainbow behind you. Then come upright, separate your hands, dive forward and all the way down. Inhale, lift to a tabletop, it's a flat back. Exhale, fold over, drop your head. Separate your feet a little wider than they are and turn your toes out, turn your knees out. Squat down, your hands come to prayer. You're in a malasana, your palms come together. Breathe here, see if you can pour your weight to the outsides of your feet, less weight on the inner arches so that you're pulling up through the inseams of the feet, you're pulling up through the pelvic floor, there's a lift. There's a lift all the way from the pelvic floor to the diaphragm, to the soft palate of the mouth, to the hypothalamus in the brain, to right above your head, there's a lifting. Let's keep the palms together and reach the prayer hands to the sky. Then separate your prayer hands, push into your feet, rise up, take your hands down to hold onto your hip bones. From here, keep the feet wide, but turn the toes forward. Take your arms up to a letter V, your body is in a letter X. Take your hands down to touch your toes. Go back up to that letter X. Seven down and up. Six down and up. Five down and up. Four down and up. Three down and up. Two down and up, one down and up, hook your thumbs at the top, stretch up and over to your right, look up to the inside of your left arm. Turn your torso to the ground to the right, you'll keep your thumbs hooked and take your hands down outside your right pinky toe. Then sweep yourself forward and center, sweep over to the left pinky toe. Now here's where you're gonna take the, the thumb stay hooked but take your right arm up by your right ear so you can peek forward, then come up. Let's stay at the top and switch the grip of the thumb. Go up and over to your left. Keep your thumbs hooked and bring your torso parallel to the ground. With the thumbs hooked, bring them outside your left pinky toe. Sweep forward and center. Go over to your right pinky toe. Now here, stay here, but take your left arm up by your left ear while the thumbs are still hooked so you can look forward. Then rise up. Separate the hands. Take your hands to hold your hip bones. Walk your feet under your hips. The feet are about five, six inches apart. Bend your knees and reach your arms forward. Then reach your arms to the ceiling. You're in a chair pose with your feet hip width apart. Take your hands to prayer and then come to stand up. Breathe here. So that was our morning stretch. My name is Marissa. I hope you enjoyed this.